Hi, awesome people. Uh, thank you for watching me. And today I want to talk about this amazing book, which is called Average Song. And it was written by A.C. Salter. And it is uh, the first book in uh, the Daughter of Chaos trilogy. Uh, the second book is called Shadow Jack, and the third book is called Ithia. Okay, um, it's an amazing book. And, but to be honest, I actually felt a little reluctant to read it at first, since I usually don't like fantasy, and this is a fantasy novel. But boy, am I glad I read it, because it was such an awesome read. So it's about a girl named Elora, and although she has violet eyes and long jet black hair with a shock of blonde, she sees herself as a normal girl. But she isn't, because she's actually from a parallel world. And this world she's from, so that world she's from, is threatening Earth. So because of that, she and a group of very interesting characters set off in quest of adventure to save the planet and to save uh, the world, basically. So um, I read this book um, a while back, I'm not sure ex exactly how long it ago it was, but a couple months ago at least. And um, I wrote um, a review of this book and gave it five stars, so I want to share this review with you right now. So this is what I wrote back then. I dislike fantasy. That feeling and thought lingered in my mind when I opened A.C. Salter's Eversong. As I navigated to the first page, I told myself I needed to broaden my horizons, so I read it. And I perused the first chapter and loved Eversong from the start. Elora is a fantastic character, who I loved and related to. She guided me through the story and experienced the extraordinary events with a clarity which made the story believable. I loved every part of this book and each beautiful and less beautiful world A.C. Salter created. Great descriptions are essential to a fantasy novel, and Mr. Salter gave me just that. He also put a lot of suspense and some romance into Eversong, which I relished. So A.C. Salter made me realize fantasy contains lots of beauty. And I think all of us have a penchant for fantasy lying somewhere within ourselves. Anyhow. This book forms a treat to both fantasy lovers and non-fantasy lovers. So, having said that, that's basically all for now. So, in conclusion, read the book, because it's awesome, and um, feel free to comment on this video if you feel the need to express something, and uh, like it if you like it, and have an awesome day. Thanks for watching.